Yo, what's going on everybody? This is Desi D here. What's going on? Right now I'm about to give my opinion on top five dream artists on one album. Now you hear this one person on the radio, then you hear this another person, and then you hear both of them on one track song. But imagine if they were on they was on like an album together. Imagine that. Well, I'm about to give my top five reasons, okay? My top five Dream artists on one album and why I chose these guys. Okay? So here we go. Number five. Number five is Nicki Minaj and Beyonce on one album. Now, why I say that is because Beyonce already got Nicki Minaj on her album, and Beyonce was already is already on Nicki Minaj's album. So they both, you know, they pretty cool friends and everything, but imagine if they like made an album together. I mean, a rapper and a singer on one album. I mean, because they both can perform a crowd. They can, like, sell out an arena. So, I think it'd be pretty cool to me. That, that's number five. Number four. Now, I know I mentioned something about the Meek Mill versus Drake situation, but imagine Meek Mill and Ace Hood on that one album together. Imagine that. We the best music and MMG made bad music together on one album. This time ain't got nothing to do with DJ Kelly, got nothing to do with Rick Ross, nobody. Just both of them on that one album. Now I say that because Ace Hood he can like rap his ass off on the track list. Me Mill he can rap too, but imagine Ace Hood and them both collaborating together and making a hit. Now, I think that's pretty cool to me. Because anybody who's a Meek Mill fan and an Ace Hood fan will definitely enjoy those two albums together. Okay? Number three. Now, number three, I think, in my opinion, this could be a pretty cool album. Travis Scott and Young Thug together. Now, why I say that is because they already did one song together. They're pretty good on that song. But imagine Travis Scott and Young Thug both making huge albums, making huge hits on that album. It's pretty amazing, right? It's pretty cool. Now, I think the album will be a hit because everybody who's a Travis Scott and Young Thug fan would definitely enjoy that album. Okay? I like that. Number two. Now, the number two will be Big Sean and Slim Shady aka Eminem on one album together. Now three, these are my three reasons. Number one, they both can rap real good. Two, they both from Detroit. And three, they already made a song together. But that was on that one song. But Eminem did that song, Detroit versus Everybody, with Royce the Five Nine and Trick Daddy and a whole bunch of people, you know? Now I think it'll be pretty cool like, the album will be, like, amazing. Because Eminem has already worked with a lot of people in the past. He worked with D12. Then he worked with Royce the Five Nine. You know, I think it's, I think that Eminem has, has, has an experience of working with somebody on an album. Big Sean, he can rap, too. Definitely. So, I think that they should make an album, they should make an album together. Number one. <laughs> Number one, well, I think who, whoever is watching this can actually agree with me on this. Number one should be The Weeknd and Chris Brown on one album. If they make an album together in real life, you know how exciting I would be? I would be excited as hell to see EXO and Breezy on one album. I mean, because they can both get that high note. Okay, Chris Brown he can rap his ass off just like just just like the singing. We can he can sing his ass off. So imagine like imagine that they they both can work together on an album. Now I think that's pretty amazing. Now for those of you who do not know, Chris Brown has already worked with like with Trey Songz on a, on some remixes. Okay? They did some remix songs. 
case y'all who didn't who didn't know. And, and if you don't know, check it out. It's Chris Brown and Trey Songs song together. But it's not about Trey Songs. It's about the weekend and Chris Brown. Okay? So I think the weekend and Chris Brown should tear down that album. And you know how many awards they're gonna get? You know how many tickets they're going that's gonna sell? If they made a song together and they perform it on stage, come on now. That will be absolutely amazing to me. So, yeah. That's my top five opinion. My top five opinions on Dream Al dream Artists on one album. I think it would be really amazing. I think it would be really cool. And I hope it does happen one day in the future. We never know. So, it's 2016. So, we never know what's going to happen, okay? We don't know. So, if you agree with me on this, put a like and comment on the bottom of this video. And during the comment section below, just let me know who you who do you want to make an album together. And if you agree with me, put a like and comment on the bottom of this video. And if you agree, agree with me, put also comment, comment that you agree with me or something like that. But let me know who do you want on one album. Let me know, and I'll check it out, okay? Oh, and follow me on Instagram on Desi16Ray. Follow me on Twitter on DesiD4. So, that's all I, that's all I have for today. Peace out, y'all.